YouTube, Sugar Free here. Um, I posted a video a few days ago, talked about um, starting this a revamp or a 2.0 or next level project of the good old Trail Finder 2. Um, I mentioned that one of the big things I was going to do was work on doing a custom interior. <clears throat> um, Monday I had um, my interior come in from Dinky RC and as you can see it's pretty well underway. Um, right here, do a little close up. This is the the dashboard and the floor plan. Floor pan. I got a little tongue tied there of the interior. Um, I also ordered the cheap seats that um, are an option for them. Now this is also the deluxe interior. Just you know, if you look on their website, a lot more detail. Um, got a bunch of random shit here that. It's gonna go in like I believe this piece goes into the dash right there. Um, this is gonna end up being the steering column, I believe. A few others. I guess they just nice little random pieces, as well as the door panels right here. Um, so far, I've tried doing some mocking up to this. It actually, fits very very well. I was kind of surprised on their website. They mentioned a lot about, or he mentioned. I believe um, having to duct tape, oh here's also the back panel, <coughs> or not duct tape, do some velcro to get them to attach up, but with this um, Mojave body I'll show you, actually has a chunk of these different screws, all of that right here, yeah I know my videography is not the best, um, but I noticed as I was mocking up the dash and the floor panel, in there even this back piece seems like they pretty much match up to every one of those holes that you see right there um, I'm going to be kind of curious to see if I'm gonna to have to do any um, battery placement modifications but any of us that are to crawling especially to play with SCX 10s or Wraiths no that's pretty common procedure here when you're you're doing one of these to get that weight just right where you want it but anyway I just wanted to do a a quick update as to how this little project was coming um, haven't done the electronic swap as you can see um, from here I think it's just doing some details also kinda of debating what I'm gonna do with the bed here um, I've been um, contemplating some ideas I've even kinda of as of um, the last day or so even been thinking about turning into like a Chinook, you know, that has um, the camper basically built in, it's not a bed, the Chinook basically becomes part of this whole thing and I might get some styrene and just kind of screw around with that and see how it looks, but anywho, that's it for now, look forward to you on the next one, like and subscribe, thanks.